From day one of the Columbus Blue Jackets, Aaron Portsline has been there writing and reporting on the team, first with the Columbus Dispatch and now with The Athletic. As a hockey writer, he's seen plenty of fights in 23 seasons, but this season he's been in one of his own. Whitney Harding joins us now. The hockey community in Columbus strong, but this is really next level. It really is. I mean, Porty has had kidney disease for years. It actually runs in the family, so he wasn't surprised to find out he had it. And in fact, multiple family members of his have already had transplants. So. He's familiar with the process, but that can also mean that they can't donate. So finding a match or possibility in his family, that was a no-go. The thing is, he is part of another family, the Blue Jacket family. I've always been trained to not be the story, and so I've, we've sort of tried to keep this encouraging people to donate. In October, the Athletic CBJ reporter Aaron Portsline put a post up on social media that simply said, I am not well. He then went on to tell a chapter of his story that he was in kidney failure. Quickly, he turned the page and the focus towards organ donation. It's one of the few things we agree on uh, right now in society that organ donation is a good thing. The outpouring of support was immediate and immense. Porty said he was fortunate to have many friends step up and go through the process to see if they could be his donor. A couple even made it to the final testing stage, but they were ruled out. I was kind of in a dark place after I heard because, you know, dialysis is not fun. So let's go back. Remember that social media post from before? As we scroll down through the massive number of responses, take a look at this one. It's from Lindy Knoll, who is part of the CBJ's communications team. I'll do whatever I can to help. So I started off, I think, like like many other people, and I just filled out the questionnaire. I lost my father in 2018 to cancer. There, there was no donation that could save his life. So this felt like something that I could do to make a difference in someone else's life. A questionnaire led to lab work, which led to tests. And in March, Lindy got the news she was a match. A few weeks later, she invited Porty to Nationwide Arena under the guise of an interview about organ donation. That there is a match. I don't know who the match is yet. Um, hoping to find out at some point this week. I'm glad that you mentioned that because that's actually the real reason why you're here. I am your donor. No way. It's doing what I would hope someone else would do for me. And for a man who works in words, Porty found himself without many. I think our, our language is limited. It doesn't seem like thank you uh, is enough. This team has always sort of transcended wins and losses is what I would say. The sense of family that the hockey community has, Porty is family. He can write some nasty things about the team if he wants critiques. to. Critiques. Critiques. He can write some critiques about the team if he wants to. But that doesn't change the fact that he is family. And I keep thinking, what's the appropriate wedding gift <laughs> for someone who gave you a kidney? That's not on any registry anyway. No. <laughs> Thanks to everybody who is willing to do this because it's incredible. It's a lifesaver. Absolutely incredible. incredible. Lindy and her fiance Chris are getting married, not this June, but next June. Porty and his wife are invited. We, we checked. They're <laughs> yeah, invited they to the, list. the wedding. And, the, and the, the surgery was today. It was today. The update that I have from Lindy's family is that she is out of surgery. It went successful. I have not received an update on Aaron just yet, but so far so good from what I'm hearing. The epitome of selfless. That's I what that is. I can't believe it. And we know Lindy really well. Yes. And we both saw her recently and she did not tell us this no on purpose nope i did not find out Oof. until i sat down to do the interview yeah. yesterday. yesterday that was her was funsy emotional. for me yeah <laughs> yesterday it was emotional yeah it was. that was amazing whitney thank you wow and the blue jackets